Shortcut girls. He can go around our offices, but he always opens the door and walks through and just zooms by and says, just taking a shortcut, guys. <laughs> he's definitely one of those people that you want in your life. Uh, he's always with a smile. He's young at heart. He, he's one of those guys where you just, if, if, if you're in a bind, you want Glenn to be there with you. Oh, sure as I am. Glenn Freeman, I'm still a bleach plant operator. I was hired June 24, 1959. Look at this picture here. Look at the original way that we unloaded wood and brought wood into the mill. It's short logs and the loggers were bringing in on uh, double axle trucks. The leaders at the mill and up in Atlanta said, let's celebrate. Georgia Pacific's total investment of $438 million to grow and expand the business right here. When they invest that much money in something, they know what they're doing, they're here to stay. Just look around and see at all the folks that are impacted by this. Met the governor and, and that's so cool. You didn't get that, did you? He's one of the people that does some of the safety orientation. He kind of went above and beyond just to make sure that I had everything that I needed. Yeah, he's very energetic and there wasn't a dull moment. Shazam! There's a good reason why his office is right when you come in the front door because when you see him, he, he, he puts a good start to your day. You know, I'm 76. I reckon I, somewhere down I found, you know, I'm pretty happy here and I go to the mailbox. His longevity speaks a lot to his work ethic and his commitment. I try to learn something every day. Ooh, and, and I peck around and I got it, I got it. Feels pretty good. He has an immediate impact on you as a person. I wasn't expecting him to be so energetic. I'm passionate about what I do. No mail today. I don't even see a generational gap there when we're talking about things that, that matter. Can you teach an old dog new tricks? <laughs> Maybe so, Walt. Maybe so. Maybe you're looking at it.